Zipboard isn't just your ordinary collaboration tool. It's a streamlined platform designed to make the review process for zip files seamless and productive. Whether you're a content creator, a designer, or a developer, Zipboard has got you covered. Let's dive right in. In order to annotate zip files, we need to add content by clicking on this button and select zip files. Once we're done uploading, we will see this review button and once we click on this, it'll open a new tab. Let's start right here. You will see all of the annotation tools in the left hand side. You can use the rectangle tool to comment on specific areas of the screen. You can add your comment and click on this button. If you need to emphasize something, the pencil tool will help you circle, underline, or highlight elements within this area. Let's just try adding a comment and click on this button again. Now, this button lets you highlight specific text. Let us try this one right here. And so you can see the same functionalities. You will have this comment option just like the other two in here. Another thing is that when you need to direct attention, you can rely on this arrow tool. And you don't have to worry about making mistakes because the eraser tool lets you remove annotations. Now, if the comments obstruct your view, no problem. Just click on the hide button to tuck them away while keeping your valuable feedback intact. Want to bring back the comments once more? A simple click on the unhide button restores them for your convenience. Now, there are times that just have to take a screenshot. You can capture the visible screen by clicking on this designated option, which displays the area in this green border. You can annotate and add comments by utilizing all these tools in here. Once you're done annotating, you can access these annotations in the slideshow mode after exiting the screenshot by clicking on this X button. Now the slideshow function allows you to see all of your screenshots, screen recordings, and comments. You can also add annotations and comments in a slideshow view. If you want to review your content in the device type that you want to review, you can just click on that button and you will see here in this way and you can annotate right here. You can exit this one by clicking on this X button. Another thing is that you can change the content status of this asset. You can select on this area right here. The last thing is that you can actually disable comments. In this way, we can add annotations without commenting using this option. There you have it. 